Got some old bananas lying around? No problem. Let's make some chocolate chip banana bread. So when my husband and I decided to get healthy during the pandemic, one of the things that came out of that was I started incorporating alternate flours and sweeteners into my baking. Not stevia. I hate stevia. So as a result, I now have quite a few recipes that incorporate things like whole wheat flour and oat flour instead of AP flour, and honey and maple syrup instead of sugar. This banana bread recipe is one of the things that came out of that, and in my opinion, is just as good, if not better, than your classic banana bread. So let's get into it. To start, we're going to preheat our oven to 325 degrees Fahrenheit, and then in a medium-sized bowl, we're going to add one third cup of canola oil and one half cup of maple syrup and whisk until combined. To that, we'll add two eggs and then about a cup of ripe mashed bananas, which is about three medium bananas or two large ones. Next, add a quarter cup of milk. I used whole milk, but a non-dairy option would work just as well. To our wet ingredients, we're going to add one teaspoon of baking soda, one teaspoon of vanilla, a half teaspoon of salt, and a half teaspoon of cinnamon, making sure to whisk until well combined. Next, mix in one and three quarters cups of whole wheat flour, mixing until just combined. And last but not least, we get to add in the best part, which is three quarters cups of chocolate chips, or to taste. I love to use the 60% Ghirardelli, but any will do. Pour the batter into a greased nine by five inch loaf pan and bake for 55 to 60 minutes. You'll know that this is done when a knife or toothpick inserted into the center comes out clean, just like this. Let the bread cool in the loaf pan for at least 10 minutes and then run a knife around the edges to help it release. You can turn it out onto a cutting board like I am here or a cooling rack, whatever is your preference. Give it a little smack if you need to and voila, a perfectly baked loaf of banana bread. This smelled so good and despite the fact that it wasn't entirely cool yet, I just had to slice into it and have a piece. We got a nice distribution of chocolate chips and this was the perfect way to end my evening. Let me know if you make this. Bye!